Hey guys, it's Nico's with TechThrow, and Apple has started to approve applications that allow you to use the LED light on your iPhone 4 as a flashlight. Uh, now we all know there's a trick to do this, which is to go ahead and open your camera, you know, set it to video, and then set the light to on, and there you go. Light will turn on, and you could use it like this for as long as you want. Uh, when you lock the screen, it turns off, of course, and, uh, you know, when you open it back up you could do it again um, this works but it's a few extra steps some people just want an application that they can click on or tap rather and uh... light will turn right on so you don't have to go into your videos and you don't have to turn the light on um, just a little more convenient so i've downloaded four free applications there are more paid applications and i'm sure there are more free applications and I'm sure by the time most of you see this video, there'll be a lot more applications up. This is actually the, uh, I believe it's the first day they were approved. So uh, these are four of the free applications that I have found so far. Um, and I figured we'd take a look at them, see what uh, we've got so far. So uh, first up is Flashlight 4G. And this has a pretty nice interface. Um, you can see a little uh, flashlight right there. And all you have to do is click on the... Uh, the button on the flashlight and your LED will turn right on. So as you can see I've got a bunch of crap on the table which is a mess right now. Um, so go ahead and click that and it turns right on. Um, of course when you exit the app it turns off and when you lock the screen as so um, you know the light will turn off as well and this is the case for all four of these specific applications so um, you can't run it while the screen is off or in the background. I'm not sure if other applications let you do that, um, but these four don't. And this particular application, uh, Flashlight 4G, when you tap the app, you still have to tap the button on the flashlight for it to turn on and off. And this actually has a cool feature where you can enable blinking, and that will just uh, blink the flashlight just like that in a pattern. So um, no SOS pattern or anything, just on and off, which could also be um, coming very handy in case you're in trouble or something. It'll attract more attention. And as you can see, this is supported by iAds. I still haven't seen any iAds myself. It's the first one. Um, and it, it, it seems to be empty at the moment. So, um, you know, who knows what they'll fill that one with. So that was uh, Flashlight 4G. Sorry about that. And let's go to the next one. This one just says light on it. And it appears to be a little buggy. There we go. Now this one does um this one does turn on automatically, so when you launch the application, you know, as you can see the light turns on by itself, you don't have to go ahead and tap that. Um but you can turn it on and off like this. And I didn't mean to say it was buggy, just earlier the screen was displaying the GUI for some reason. Um, and you can also enable a flash option. So you can have a flash, you can have a strobe, um, either very slowly. And as you, as you bring this over to the left, it'll start going faster and faster until finally you get to the end and it's almost not even... Uh, not even noticeable at the at that point. It is noticeable, but not not too much. It goes so fast that you know you only see a few of those flashes. But if you bring it back a little more, you get more of a, tro a strobe effect. And you can also click the arrows to uh, bring it up in increments if you don't want to. Um, you know, if you want to get that that right spot. So as you can see, it's strobing. That's a cool effect. Um, and if you want to turn that off, you just go ahead and click that lightning bolt at the bottom. So that one just says light. Uh, I forget the exact name of it, but I'll post it up on the video as an annotation or something. Uh, you know, just to clarify which one this is. And actually, it looked like uh, an iAd did pop up. That might be uh, why the screen goes blank sometimes, because that looks like there's an iAd up there. You can see it for a split second. There you go. So now it seems to be working. And this is actually the iAd for... Uh, I believe it's a Nissan Leaf, which is an electric car coming out soon by Nissan. And the next one is called LED Flashlight. Go ahead and check that one out. 
and uh, this one does turn on automatically as well and the actual screen on the front actually lights up white so you can kind of use it as a flashlight if you wanted to uh, though I, I don't see a point since you do have the LED light on it and at the bottom you have the option to just turn it on and off that's it there no strobing um, just a simple on off application and finally we have another one called LED torch flash flashlight and again this is a simple GUI just on and off so uh, go ahead and click that off and this is IAD supported as well and then you can go ahead and flick that on and it doesn't seem to be turning on for some reason let's try that again yeah again it's not turning on um, maybe you have to click the IAD nope doesn't seem to be working so uh, I'm not quite sure if I'd recommend this one just yet uh, it might be still uh, working out a few kinks in the software try that again by killing it in the taskbar and there we go now it seems to be working uh, I did run it earlier so it was kind of in my taskbar at the bottom so I could have been messing with it um, but yeah so far I think uh, this one called light is my favorite uh, just because it's a uh, nice clean GUI and you, you have that uh, that strobing effect that you could you have a lot of uh, control over um, none of these offer SOS or anything like that um, they're kind of uh, you know they're all free uh, they all seem ad supported though the ads aren't intrusive you know it's uh, or obtrusive rather it's um you know they're eye ads so nice and clean uh, they don't seem to be working 100% just yet as we saw in uh, two or three of these apps they were the eye ads were blank so um, this is nice as well I like the interface on this but uh you know the strobing feature of the other one uh, is definitely my favorite so this is really cool this would definitely be my application my 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 uh, I'm sorry my flashlight application of choice at the moment as far as free ones go it's uh, light and I'll be posting the full name to that uh, in the description and uh, maybe even in the video um, so you could check that out um, but yeah this is just a quick look at four of the free applications that allow you to use the LED light on your iPhone 4 as a flashlight. Uh, as usual, please uh, check out our other videos. Feel free to rate this video and subscribe uh, for future content. My name is Nikos, and thank you very much for watching. Bye-bye.